We are following new developments in the deadly shooting at the Mall of America. Tonight, there is a nationwide search for a 17-year-old charged with murder. Prosecutors say that LaVon Longstreet and 18-year-old Tayshawn Adams Wright shot and killed Jonte Hudson inside the mall last week. Adams Wright is already in custody on murder charges. Two other teenagers are also charged in this case. WCCO's Alan Henry is here right now to break down what we know so far. Hi, Alan. Hi, Amelia. Yeah, the charging documents gave a look into the last moments of Jonte Hudson's life before he was gunned down inside the Mall of America. We're also learning more about the suspects accused of taking his life. According to court documents, surveillance video captured 18-year-old Tayshawn Adams Wright and 17-year-old LaVon Longstreet arguing with Jonte Hudson. Adams, Wright, and Longstreet were armed with handguns with extended magazines and chased Hudson through the Nordstrom store. The complaint says two other 17-year-olds, both now charged with second-degree riot, can be seen in the video, blocking Hudson from escaping the store, one of them tackling Hudson to the ground. The documents say clothing displays blocked some camera views, but the video shows Longstreet pointing a gun at Hudson and a muzzle flash. Then Adams Wright and Longstreet standing over Hudson in a shooting stance with another flash. Longstreet's warrant says he is believed to have left the state and that he, quote, or others are in danger of imminent harm. The exact reason behind the shooting seemingly remains a mystery at this time. Bloomington police released a statement today echoing what the chief told us the day after the shooting. The why here is the thing that we still don't understand because no one is cooperating with us. Uh, we believe that this is some type of uh, longstanding feud. Well, Adams Wright will go before a judge tomorrow. As for the two 17-year-olds charged with riot, a judge ordered them to stay in detention because the, quote, public safety danger factor is extremely high. One of those teenagers, an honor student with a prior gun charge still going through the system, the other, a football player that planned to accept a college athletic scholarship. Amelia. All right, Alan, thank you. We, of course, will continue to follow the aftermath of this deadly shooting. Stay with WCCO on TV and online for the latest updates.